Hello, if you need to delete a lot of products from your Shopify store, it can become a really boring and time consuming task. This is why we created Smart Bulk Delete Products app. And in this video, I will show you how you can actually delete easily a lot of products from your store based on your criteria. So first, let's uh, open our app. When you uh, first will see our app, you can uh, simply click here to create a new job. And then here so you will see a lot of uh, criteria. All of these are optional. If you just need to delete all products, you can directly click on preview products and uh, it will show you the products that will be deleted and then you can simply delete. But if you need to select some criteria and uh, then you can use these fields here. So let's say I want to select all draft products from the vendor Adidas. And let's preview these products. Okay, I see all these products. Then if I just uh, think that that's right products to be deleted, I can simply cl click on delete products and delete all of them. It will job will start uh, deleting it in the background. You don't need to wait if it's thousands of products. It will handle it easily. Uh, then let's create another task. Let's say uh, this time we want to delete uh, product from specific collection, summer collection. Again, we can combine it with all other rules. But for this example, I will just show you how it looks like. So here you will see all the uh, products in this collection and you will see what will be deleted and then you can also prefer to delete on the images so let's say i want to get rid of this uh, old images uh, this will upload it wrongly so uh, let's delete them and i will upload new images uh, so it also can handle this task for you so when we go back now and again if we check uh, these products one more time we will see images are gone and now we can also simply delete all the products as well just for an example and it will also delete uh, all these images all these products sorry <laughs> okay so let's uh, try another task this time i want to use multiple vendors so let's say adidas and puma and i want to display yeah, let's uh, first display all out of stock ones. Preview products. Yeah, I see Adidas and Puma all out of stock products. And uh, let's say I just want to delete Adidas, Puma and all draft ones. Draft and out of stock. Let's preview them. Yeah, we see all the Puma ones are because we already deleted all the draft Adidas. Uh, we can now delete all Puma products as well. And then while our job is running, we can actually also create another job. We don't have to wait for this. Uh, let's say I want to search for all Adidas products one more time. Okay, this time I see this products has stock. Three of them should have stock. And let's say I just want to delete out of stock ones. So I say Adidas and I choose out of stock here and I can also select the date but it, I, I will show it later. So preview products, now let's delete them. In the meanwhile we will see in the dashboard our other task is finished. It. We can check details of it but uh, it, we will also send you email. Okay, now other task also finished. Now I want to see products of Adidas not out of stock. Let's just see what's left. Okay, we just see three of them. We can also delete them, but we can uh, leave them as well. Okay, uh, this time I want to show you some date range. Uh, here we designed by default, it comes older than five years. So it's designed to delete mostly old products so if you need to delete older than five years four years you can also manually play here with dates yourself uh, but let's say i want to delete product created in last seven days 
because maybe I just made import and I imported something wrong. You can always also change its specific dates here uh, and uh, apply whatever custom dates you want. Okay, let's preview all the products in that date range. Uh, so this is like very new. I actually created it yeah, 14 hours before and uh, all these products are also can be deleted. And you can also combine all these uh, rules together, uh, so it will always narrow down your search. So if you want to, in specific collection, delete products which has uh, uh, like out of stock or specific vendor in specific collection, you can also do that. And uh, all of this uh, gives you a lot of flexibility and you can always preview all the products and uh, uh, simply delete whatever uh, you will approve so it will not delete anything automatically without your approval without you seeing all the results so yeah i uh, hope it will save you a lot of time from doing a boring uh, deleting task in shopify admin so have a nice day